What up, DC? I'm Maricela. And I'm Max. It's Thursday, August 18, 2016, National Fajita Day. Hey, did you know I wrote, just wrote a song about fajitas? No, you did? Well, it's more of a rap, really. Hey everyone, our media center has a new website, Facebook page, Twitter, and Instagram account. Check them out, like, comment, subscribe, follow, share, plus one, upvote, poke, retweet, favorite, repost, and never miss the latest news from the school library. By the way, you can still pick up an ordered yearbook in the large conference room after school. Pick them up by today. Attention sophomores, juniors, and seniors, if you want to be a part of the Y Club, make plans to attend the organizational meeting on Wednesday after school in room 213. If you can't attend but still want to be in, see Mr. Easley to pick up important info. Attention future world travelers, there will be an informational meeting about a summer trip to Costa Rica in Nicaragua on August 31 at 7 p.m. in the Media Center. The trip will include kayaking, snorkeling, zip lining, going to the beach, and more. We have 14 students going so far, and space is limited, so please see Ms. Venegas in room 200B if you would like to come. Hey, upperclassmen. If you ordered Jostens, today is delivery day during lunch. If you still have a balance due on your order, it can be paid with cash, a money order, or credit slash debit card. No checks will be accepted. If you forgot to order your class jewelry on the original order day, you can still place your order today. If you need class jewelry resized or repaired, they, they can take care of that too. Hey student council, there will be a meeting on Thursday at 7.40 in Miss Gimme Horn's room. And freshmen interested in student council, petition will be available at required meeting tomorrow at 7.45 a.m. in room 22B. They are to be returned to Mr. Crop in room 225 by 3.30 on Friday, August 26th. Campaigning is August 26th through Election Day, Tuesday, September 6th. Any questions, check with Mr. Crop in room 225. Attention 2015-2016 Foods and Nutrition students. Stop by Miss Selby's room if you're still interested in the cooks around the world. If you're participating, you must attend the informational meeting next Monday. Mr. Norris's art students from last spring, pick up your art. Now stay tuned for a word for our principals. Hey, Pantherland, this is Mr. Blue. I want to tell you a little bit about uh, checking out of school. If you check out of school, please make sure you stop by the front office. We are required by law to have a parent signature or a student signature. So, for example, if the front office calls you and says that, uh, John Smith is checking out of school. That person needs to come down to the front office and sign out. Please make sure you do that. Again, it's required. We have to have a parent signature or student signature. Want to make sure that you keep that all important exam exemption. Thank you. I understand that we are a tobacco free campus. Um, obviously, we do not allow tobacco uh, on campus, whether it's cigarettes, uh, smokeless tobacco. Um, the e-cigs, uh, none of that paraphernalia needs to be at school. If you are found with that on you, uh, then you will be charged uh, by our school resource officer, Deputy Woodford. The last thing I want to talk to you about today is uh, bullying or harassment. It's on page 33 of your uh, agenda books. It's uh, defined as any unwanted or unwelcome words, physical violence, threatening, stalking, or generally tormenting another for any reason, especially due to race, color, uh, national origin, age, religion, marital status, political relief, sex, or a disability. Um, anything that's unwanted, unwanted touching, unwanted name calling, jokes, spreading rumors, be careful about that. You know, just because you hear something from someone does not mean it's true. Um, you need to talk to the person to find out for sure and you need to do it appropriately. 
Um, if someone is bothering you, instead of going back to them and tormenting them back, come tell an adult. Tell, tell me, tell an administrator or a teacher. We will help take care of it. But we do not allow bullying, harassment here at school. We do not want it. It does not need to be a part of what we're doing here. Again, that's taken away from the education process here at Davis County High School and uh, we, um, we will hold you accountable for that. So please, treat people like you want to be treated. Treat people with respect, even if you're disrespected. It's the hardest thing to do, but it's the best thing to do. It's the right thing to do. Um, teasing a uh, student's um, subject choice or um, assignment based uh, or personal attributes of a student you know, we do not need that no matter what. We do not tease. Uh, sometimes you think, well, I'm just, I'm just teasing, but teasing is a form of harassment. We're not going to do that because it causes people to get upset, uh, feel bad about themselves. We don't want that. This, is, this should be a risk-free environment. So you guys that are seeing this happen, if it's not done to you and done to someone else, the worst thing you could do is laugh. The worst thing you do is just play along with it. Don't let that happen. If you see it happen, stop it. Say, hey, we're not going to do that. It's not right. We don't treat people that way. Um, it says stalking could be also stalking a person, following them, or generally mentally harassing another student. Those are all forms of harassment or bullying. If you see it, again, talk to an adult. Tell someone, anyone here at school. Tell an administrator. We will work and handle it. We will take care of it. Uh, if you don't want to do that and you want it to be anonymous, there's a couple different ways you can handle that. On the Davis County Public Schools website, there is a uh, icon. It's uh, the stop tip line. It looks like a, uh, a road sign, a stop sign. You click on that and you can enter information, anything that you want to put in there that you see that might be uh, inappropriate, whatever. If you have a tip, you want to leave that tip, it goes to central office and then they send us that information and then we uh, handle it from there. Also, you could pick up a hassle log. It's a red sheet of paper in the front office. You can pick up one of those and you can write down what's going on. Do not leave your name. That's fine. You can, it can be anonymous. But if, if you see anything suspicious and you want to let someone know anonymously, you can, do, you can pick up one of those and uh, give it to the front office and then they will make sure that we, we get that. And here's what's going on today at D.C. Johnston's is here. Boys golf will be traveling to take on Ohio County at 4 p.m. Boys soccer will be traveling to take on Catholic with JV game at 5.30. That's it for today, DC. Have a great day.